Okay, so this is the tutorial video for how to do the interlaced polyhedra V3. Now the first thing you need to have built is the entire construction of the interlaced stars, just like I did in my last video. And really this is 95% of the work already done. Um, the last thing that you need is 19 of these points. And the way that you make them is you start off with uh, stacked rings of 16, smash them together into a long straight piece, uh, attach them like this, and this is the same way that I make all of the uh, triangular points that I've done so far. Take those three magnets out in the back, uh, shear this across like so, to those three magnets in the middle are touching, bend the legs down until those three magnets that are now touching split away, take those off, add a hexagon, and add a triangle on top of that. The legs are uneven, but you want to even them all out to be the same as this one with the sideways point, rather than the two with the vertical points. So you take two magnets off of this one, the long one, and you add two magnets onto this one, the short one. And that's how you make those. And you need 19 of them. The reason you only need 19 instead of 20 is because there's already, if you remember, a support down here, and it's taking up the space of one of the triangles you just can't put one there because there's support, unfortunately. I wish you could, it could complete it, but not really doable. Um, so then you uh, take these and on each of the legs you want to, get a little bit closer, add just one magnet to each of those legs. like that. And then you add this across three points of the uh, angular pieces that you used in the interlaced stars. And this is, what you're doing here is just like what you did when you built the rhombic hexacontahedron, because you are building a rhombic hexacontahedron just interlaced with the small stellated dodecahedron, which is already complete. You just put it down just like that, and you go ahead and do the same thing to the other 18 points. All right, last piece.
there you go. That is how you build the interlaced polyhedra V3. Just like that. Kind of fun to spin. Anyway, I'm sure you want me to smash this, so here it goes.